Hey, Jay Clark here. We're gonna give you some tips on removing and installing your rotors on your dirt bike. Okay, one of the first things I like to do is use heat. Heat up the Loctite that's on the existing bolt. This is a Yamaha. They're all a little bit different, all the brands. The Yamaha is one of the easiest to damage the heads of the Allen bolts here. They're very shallow, um, and if you don't put some heat to them, you will round these off, even with a good uh, Allen wrench. And they just come right off if you uh, have them heated up. Applying the new rotor, to your other hub. You just wanna make sure everything's clean, nothing's in here on both surfaces, and line it up. Now for this, we from Dennis Kirk, we have brand new bolt kits. I like to get brand new bolts. They're really inexpensive for a bolt kit's like $10. Most of them come with a little bit of Loctite. I still like to put especially a dab up in here. These are one part that I'll always have Loctite on. So I like to drive these down, just get them all like 90% on. They're just all touching. N none of them are tight yet. So I like to wipe off that uh, Loctite before it dries on there. And then my uh, Allen wrench set up here, I just to get a good feel. Again, taking your time. These are really shallow bolts, so that's why I like to get make sure I'm all the way pushing down and in there. That's all there is to it on this front one. Uh, we'll do the same thing on a rear one. Anyway, hopefully that helps you out. I'll see you later.